Welcome back to the vlog. It has been a little while. Had a pretty busy fall, documenting all sorts of adventures, doing lots of hunting myself. So here's a little teaser of what I've been up to. You guys smell that? What is it? Freedom. Mm. Every rifle scope we make is made right down in this factory. Sick. Now it is middle of November, back to a snowy and cold Montana, and Karen, my wife, and I are going mule deer hunting. Trying to get her her first mule deer. It's about 10 degrees out right now, and the whole next week is about gonna be that cold, so. I have pizza! <laughs> We're gonna fuel up with some pizza, and then uh, start hunting. Ooh. What flavor? Pepperoni. Oh yeah. <laughs> All right, let's go hunting now. <laughs> back to the camper. It was really snowy out there. Probably did like a three mile loop and it took us like six hours. <laughs> didn't see much. Saw like two deer tracks, but didn't actually see any deer. So tomorrow we're gonna change it up. We're gonna road hunt in the morning. And I say that because it's literally, I think the best play because we can see the most country and just keep moving, try to figure out where the deer are at. So road hunting is a tactic tomorrow. It's about eight o'clock. We're really tired, gonna hit the hay, but before we hit the hay, we're gonna have some hot chocolate. Cheers. And good morning. It is one degrees outside right now. It is really cold. We're just driving some roads, looking for deers. Kara and I were just recently in Mexico and either we ate something bad or we picked up a little bug. A little uh, gastro distress. I'll leave it at that. <laughs> Well, everybody else had the same idea this morning. Lots of people road hunting. So we only went about a mile and jumped into a kind of a trail system. And gonna go see what we can see. Chocolate and the Yeti thermos. That's good. <laughs> I 
Haven't seen any deer yet, but cutting a few tracks. Karen and I just put on our puffy pants. She's using the uh, Sika Kelvin Down light pants, and I've got the Blizzard Aero light pants. Very warm. We've also got these guys right here. These are Arctic Shield boot insulators. I've always wondered, I was like, okay, we have insulation for everything from our legs to our jacket to our hands, but we don't have any insulation layers to put on our feet once we stop. They do exist. Arctic Shield boot insulators today. Put them on probably 10 minutes ago and both of my feet were basically frozen. Couldn't feel my toes and now 10 minutes in I can feel my toes. So pretty stoked on these so far. We're gonna sit here for most of the rest of the day. Eat some pizza, eat some hot chocolate. Drink some hot chocolate. Drink some hot chocolate. <laughs> Today was a lot of hiking in a lot of deep snow and we didn't see a single deer. On to tomorrow. Morning day three, starting it off with a little dessert for breakfast. Gastronome peach cobbler. Lost track of the forest through the trees, forgot what I was chasing. Been so many nights living out at sea that my heart is gone vacant. And everybody who was close to me all stayed on dry land. So now I'm driving back on in the state west. I just gotta feel something. Not gonna wait till the morning because something's gonna change my mind. I don't wanna change my mind. For day three, we saw moose, two bucks, and a handful of does. Morning of day four, came out by myself. Karen and I still, still have a little gut rot from our uh, Mexico trip, we assume. <laughs> anyway, she's staying back at the camper. Of course, I found a pretty nice buck. Big, tall, three-point. 300 yards, so. Nice well, the whole damn town has been waiting for the day when you would come back here. Back here. There was dancing and talking and steaks on the grill, and I think that I will be alright. And my ex from high school still looks just the same as she did back in 2009. Not gonna wait till the morning. Let's never put the night on night. Never put the night on night. All right, we just wrapped up day four this evening. Karen busted out her old uh, her old grunt call here and literally grunted. You want to give us an example of your grunt? <laughs> and literally three seconds later, like five deer popped out and there's a little buck. She's like, there's a deer! And I'm like, quit messing with me. She's like, I'm not! And I'm like, yeah, uh-huh. And then, oh, there's five deer. So this grunt tube is super special. It's got a compass built into it. So she translocated the deer and called them in at the same time, apparently. So yeah, they work today, so we'll, we'll probably pack it around tomorrow. <laughs> you want to, what do you want to do? Oh, I wanna see right here, right here. This morning was cold and windy. Perfect hiking weather. Perfect hiking weather, as I would say, but it was actually so cold and so windy that didn't matter how hard you hiked, you were still cold. I uh, eagerly ran back to the truck, jumped in the camper, turned the heater on, drank some hot chocolate. It was great. So we've seen some deer around. Nothing, nothing big. A couple smaller bucks, most of which are down on on some private land. So I think we're gonna relocate. Might go back to where we saw that that three point a couple days ago. So we shall see. Well, the whole damn town has been waiting for the day when you would come back here. 
There was dancing and talking and steaks on the grill And I think that I will be alright And my ex from high school still looks just the same as she did back in 2009 Not gonna wait till the morning Let's never put the night on ice Never put the night on ice Back to the house now. We wrapped up that deer hunt. Uh, went back up to the spot that I had seen that nice three point, and lo and behold, he was in the exact same spot. He looks like an old buck, kind of got an old Roman nose on him, and just a massive body, but he just wasn't quite blessed with big headgear. So, either way, really cool to just sit there and watch him do his thing, and yeah. So, we're gonna shift gears now, go do some elk hunting. Got about a week left in the season and we're gonna see what we can find. But that is a wrap on this vlog. Hope you enjoyed it. If you did, hit the like button. If you wanna see more, hit subscribe. Doing both would help me out a ton. We'll see you next time.